Hi guys and welcome back on my YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about beauty regarding hair. This beauty episode is dedicated to hair care and I just wanted to share with you which is my new hair care routine since I cut my hair and a few hairstyles that I really really love and how to achieve them pretty quickly when you have this kind of length. So today we're going to talk about Philips Prestige, the hair dryer I've been using for a while now. You guys know I've been using the Philips hair dryers for, I mean, since maybe I think it's been like six years or something like this and now I have the new and updated version by the way this video is sponsored by them so I just wanted to make something maybe more interesting and just um, come up with um, different hairstyles for you guys that you can actually rock pretty easily when you have this length now Asia Express has been one of the toughest adventures of our lives and definitely it impacted the way our hair looked as you guys know when I came back in Romania I just chopped my hair because I just felt like I had uh, my hair quality wasn't just what I wanted so I just wanted to just start fresh and just enjoy my beautiful hair again and I planned to have this kind of a length like a bob cut and I was like okay this is the perfect moment to do it so I chopped my hair uh, but I do think that a long time the Philips hairdryer, the moisture protect one I was using before, helped me achieve longer, healthier looking hair and just keep the hydration in and everything in between. Now this new one, the new one we're going to talk about today, first of all gives you 30% faster hair drying time. So this, this was my absolutely favorite thing about it. The fact that I can actually blow dry my hair faster. And after this, you're going to see that it just helps keep the moisture locked in as in it has this infrared sensor which is going to measure the temperature of your hair so it makes sure that it's going to keep all the moisture locked in so you don't over dry it you know as i said in my igtv videos like you know your hair doesn't come with instructions am i blow drying it enough is it too much i don't know so uh this blow dryer definitely it is a good investment it is called sense iq Philips Prestige, this is how you're going to find it online. We're testing it out today and I'm going to tell you more about the features pretty soon. Now the products I'm using right now on my hair is the whole range from Kerastas called Genesis. I've seen such a big difference in hydration ever since I first used the shampoo. Uh, I'm going to pop them over here so you can see the range. This is the shampoo and then we have the conditioner and uh, detangling serum that's also going to help with heat tools and stuff like that and also a serum we're going to apply the serum right now on the roots this is the serum I'm talking about this is the kind of um, serum that's going to help with fortifying the hair from the roots I'm just going to the office today we're going to have a shooting for infuse and then for the blog sale so I just wanted to have you know a simple hairstyle have my hair uh, fresh and ready to go I'm going to get you guys into my updated hair care routine and what I use so firstly I use the Kerastase product so we're just going to start with the serum this much this is a trick I'm going to use if I'm going to go for a middle parting I'm just going to do it from the start while I start blow drying my hair so the hair can actually get used to the shape and then we're just going to start using the hair dryer Philips Prestige hair dryer now it has the infrared sensor I already told you about and it has a few buttons over here you can control the speed and you can control the temperature so you can style it with lower temperature or higher temperature and it has some um, uh, preset programs fast gentle manual style and so on and with the sensor you're going to be sure that everything you need the moisture is just going to be locked in now i've been using this one for a while and since i had the other one the moisture protect before i can say i've seen such a big difference but philips hair dryers by default they are just amazing at keeping uh, the moisture locked in the hair now this one what i like about this one what i really really love about this one is the fact that it has it's smaller and just easier to use the other one i think was 
double in size so definitely it is a good investment better for travel as well so 30 percent faster drying of course and also the fact that just easier to use overall now i just started it as you can see it is on fast right now we can change it from here to gentle this is the gentle routine manual and in manual mode you can actually change the speed give me what i need going to put it like this and then the temperature so if you want you can go for a low speed and a low temperature and it is still hot air but it's going to be super gentle to your hair just going to go with manual today so it's going to be low temperature three points for the speed so you can see as fast as it goes so let's see how long it will take Now, since I want to blow dry my hair just straight down, I'm just going to use this brush and just go through it while we are blow drying it. And I'm also going to show you a second option in this video, the one where we're going to get crazy beautiful volume. I just wanted to show you guys a little eyebrow trick I have. Now I use this one, which is a 24 hours brow setter from Benefit. And I'm just going to set the brows with it like so. Just going to brush them in the shape I want. And when everything is finished and I like the shape, and this is usually going to take a little bit of time, I'm just going to use the blow dryer to just set them. This is a trick I've been using since forever. Makes your eyebrows last all day and all night if you need for an event. And it's just, this is my favorite thing to do. And I just thought since we were talking about a hair dryer why not show you this thing i'm also using my philips prestige at now the best way to do it is before applying any foundation but i keep forgetting about it so i just have to get used to it like do your eyebrows first now since i have the shape i want do i have it Look at my hair. It's going in with oh, the hair dryer. I'm just going to do the same for the other one. Looking like an owl with a hair up front. And this is not an eyebrow tutorial, but I'm going to continue with this one from Urban DK, which is the brow blade. Fill in the spaces I have. I did do this awful mistake of tweezing my eyebrows while they had makeup on. So now I have to just wait for everything to grow back and I'm just using some serums and stuff like that. But this is the best thing you can use to just fill in the spaces and get a supernatural look. You know, just get the best out of your already existent eyebrow shape and then go in and fill the gaps, fill the gaps. Mind the gap. Please mind the gap. Just going to go in with a bit of hairspray. This is on this length. And look, I genuinely love and adore cooler events, but for everyday basis, this is my go-to hairstyle. It is super easy to achieve. You don't need a lot of time to just, you know, blow dry it and add volume and stuff like that. But I'm also going to show you uh, that version. With that one, you're going to need a bit of skills or a bit of exercise, you know? So here we have it, this beautiful, Slick hair just feels hydrated and looks beautiful and I just tamed the little hairs with a bit of hairspray. So here it is, <laughs> the look. I'm just going to apply a bit of highlighter and mascara and show you the next look. to the makeup table. We need to start by sectioning our hair into four equal parts. Actually, we're going to start with the sea salt. Actually, 
the effect we're looking for right now is just to get the hair in shape as fast as possible. So if you have the time, you can just let it dry by itself. But if you want faster results, make sure you just use the blow dryer. The moment of truth managed to wait a few minutes. And now we are almost ready to go to the office. I'm in a big rush right now. Go as fast as possible. The final look is simply achieved by just brushing the hair. And that's it. We're just going to add a bit of hairspray and we are ready to go. See, everything is bouncy and moving nicely. We're just going to ruin that with a bit of a hairspray. Just like so, so I can tame whatever I need to tame, super easy to achieve retro hairstyle.